I do have a lot of bells and whistles in my typical SharePoint site, but it was about bringing together the foundational needs that I need at a moment's notice. And what I need at a moment's notice is information about my case. That's certainly the case name, case number, venue, judge, and room. But what if it's not a case in litigation yet? Maybe I need up there a date of death, a date of loss, or an important note like never call this client before 10 a.m., I can do that because it's my environment to mold as I want to. Bringing together those case resources, that court docket, that e-filing portal, often we're Mm. Googling those things, especially if we're away from our office and we're not at that desktop computer with those bookmarks. Get there faster. That's all I'm trying to do and you're probably trying to do as well. Case calendar is handled by Outlook. An application already available under Microsoft 365, and I'm always syncing with this calendar in Outlook. I can view this calendar here in SharePoint, in Outlook calendar, and as well as in Teams. And Microsoft Teams is a big application that a lot of people use. Centralizing e-distribution list information. Give your paralegals a more efficient way of getting to those emails, copy-paste into a two-message, and get there faster. I use Microsoft List as a means of centralizing case contacts, linking those two matter sites using Power Automate. Case tasks and task delegation is handled by Microsoft Planner, connected here in the SharePoint environment, available through SharePoint, Planner, and Teams. But Microsoft Planner is great for task delegation and also a wonderful collaboration tool to work in tandem with the attorneys. The document library is powered by OneDrive. And this document library can sync to your file explorer for PC users and Finder for Mac. That's amazing. I don't want to wait for a web page to load. I need a high level of access for my desktop computer. And so through this mechanism, you get that. But another additional bonus feature with this document library is that when you save documents into SharePoint document library powered by OneDrive, it immediately goes through OCR for text recognition. Microsoft is categorizing your documents for HIPAA sensitivities and data loss prevention policies. Wildly important when we're dealing with major security issues when on the web, when in the cloud. But syncing this library kept a lot of us in our creature of habit moments. That's where we're used to navigating through our files. I'm a trial paralegal. And so I have created a virtual war room space, which I start three months out at least from trial with a countdown timer. So we're always aware that seconds and minutes are literally passing (laughs) us by. 